Welcome back, everyone. Today, we have an exciting topic for all the beginners out there who want to explore the world of investing in the stock market. In this video, we'll cover the basics and help you get started on your investment journey. So, let's dive in. Investing in the stock market can be a great way to grow your wealth over the long term. But before you jump in, there are a few key things you need to know. Let's start with selecting a brokerage account. A brokerage account is like a gateway to the stock market. It's an online platform that allows you to buy and sell stocks and other investments. When choosing a brokerage account, consider factors like fees, ease of use, research tools, and customer support. Some popular options include XYZ Brokerage, ABC Trading, and 123 Investing. Do your research and find the one that suits your needs. Now that you have a brokerage account, it's time to understand some stock market terminology. Don't worry, it's not as complicated as it may seem. First, we have stocks. Stocks represent ownership in a company. When you buy a stock, you become a shareholder and have a claim on the company's assets and profits. Then we have shares. Shares refer to the individual units of stock that are bought and sold in the stock market. When you purchase shares, you own a portion of the company. Understanding stock charts is also essential. Stock charts show the historical price movements of a stock over time. They can help you identify trends and make informed investment decisions. Pay attention to factors like support and resistance levels, moving averages, and trading volume. Next, conducting research on companies is crucial before investing. Many websites provide valuable information about companies, such as their financial statements, earnings reports, and news updates. Some popular research platforms include XYZ Finance, ABC Investments, and 123 Stock Research. Take the time to analyze a company's financial health, its industry trends, and any relevant news that may impact its stock price. Lastly, let's talk about diversifying your investment portfolio. Diversification means spreading your investments across different asset classes, industries, and regions to reduce risk. Instead of putting all your eggs in one basket, diversification allows you to minimize potential losses and maximize potential gains. That wraps up our beginner's guide to getting started in the stock market. Remember, investing in stocks requires patience, research, and a long-term perspective. Start small, learn as you go, and always seek to expand your knowledge. Happy investing!